So I had a comment in my last video about cutting up some of these foamies. And the guy said he uses a saw to cut this in half and then cuts his cuts them to length. Um, I think that's a good idea. Um, I was a little too lazy to go get a saw. So I'm just using a razor knife. And you gotta watch because if you're not even on the side, see how that goes in. Some are gonna be narrower, some are gonna be wider. And a little variance isn't no big deal, but um, I've had some that are too narrow and the sides of the lid don't hold them down and that's not a good thing. You want you want them to go all the way to your edges. A little wider is better than a little more narrow. And the reason why is you want to be able to, or so you want the bees to be able to propolis the foamy down. Um, one thing I've noticed too, I've had lid blows, lids blow off, but the foamy stays on. So that foamy gives them protection from any rain um, or wind or any of that. So it's really nice to at least have that sticking down if your lids blow off. Uh, if, you if you have lids heavy enough, they won't blow off or you put something on top, but I don't always do that and don't, all my lids are not heavy enough. So here's what I've been doing here. You just take this as far as to measure your width out. And we're gonna give it a little extra width here. So that one was a little wider because I was cutting down through it. So we'll just go ahead and trim a little bit of that off. Okay, it's getting a little odd here. Give me one second. No, oh, actually, I'll just deal with it. I'll deal with it. So we're gonna take this here. So depending on how much you have, leave that much of your blade out to be able to kind of cut a nice depth and not have it too weird as far as some of them being too long and other ones being too short. Just take this. If you are nice and level, you can loosen this up, make everything nice and even on one side, and then do your cuts, or just trim a whole edge off and use that as a nice straight edge to go on. Um, I'm not doing that right now, but you can do whatever works better for you. This knife is getting a little dull, but I should break a piece of it off. But... I just want to make this video real quick and get this up here for you guys. Sorry about if the wind is making a lot of noise on there. Get a little bit of a breeze. Feels good. Just about all the way around. There we go. So, now you can just unroll your foamy legs. There we go, getting about to the end of where I cut down. Some of it's starting to stick a little bit. Should be just about there, I think we're there now. No, not quite. There we go, right there. So you can see, as far as I, as deep as I had my razor blade, I got quite a bit of length here to cut for my lids. So what I've been doing is just kind of using something to mark, mark my length, and then I will come back and cut them with the scissors. Pull it tight, makes it a little easier for cutting. Whoa. Light shining in my eyes, I couldn't see. Yeah, 
and there it is. So you can see that that's actually pretty easy and um, I'll be able to do all this and then whatever length I want to do my next one I could do a whole section of that. Um, I think I'm just about done with all these um, in-framer ones for now. There's not many more here. I might go ahead and just finish that in any of them that I have torn up, replace. Not sure, but for now, that's all I need today. And that's all we're going to do. So thank you guys for watching. Thanks for the comments below. If you have any easier way of doing this or a better way, um, or just how you do it, let me know in the comments below. I'd like to hear how you're making the foamies work for you. And like I said, I think it's totally worth it. Um, whether it, your lids blow off or just to help insulate your hives from the heat or the cold, I think they do work a little better. The hives that have them on, I don't know if it's just uh, what the appearance. Maybe they're more, the bees are more at the top, but the hives just look a little bit stronger. Um, so that's one reason why I bought some more of this to do all my hives this year. I will see you guys in the next video. I appreciate you guys watching. Please like if you have not. And if you haven't subscribed, please subscribe. Um, I'll be putting some more videos up here. Things are slowing down a little bit. Now I have a little more time to get some stuff done for videos. Um, just been very busy. Haven't had time for that. So I will see you in the next video. You guys have a good day. Thanks for watching.